Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only. Coming to you with another episode of Kitty Powers' Matchmaker. Alrighty, when we left off, we were rolling right into the next episode. We had a uh, failure, our first failure in the last episode. And uh, then we rebounded straight to a perfect date right after that. So, it was just the wrong guy. Just the wrong guy. It, it, it worked out in the end. And the second one... Uh, we tried to get them to work out, uh, at least the date is interested, but it seems like our client is a little hesitant. He doesn't know enough about them, I guess. So, that's what we're going to do this episode. Try and get them a little better acquainted. Alrighty, your avatar's virtual love life. If only I had other people playing this game. Okay, I request another date with Keaton. Well, I mean, that's what you're going to get there, bud. So, we're going to do it. All right, we've already discussed occupation, horoscope, and spiciness. So, now I have to go with one of the easy ones. Let's go with one that I know. American! Route 69. That's a snazzy one. Yeah, a little bit. A little bit. We don't need to do anything. We just go. Sorry about that. I had to try and take a quick gulp of coffee. <sighs> mm. Alright, decent weather. This restaurant produces highly nutritious food, apparently. An American diner? Yeah. <laughs> Ah, Keaton, we meet again. Oh, hi, Tyrone. You're looking rosy. I'm living for this restaurant. I cannot argue with that sentiment. Hey! Nice to see you. I think we've seen you before, actually. Would you be ready to order now? Uh, affirmative. What is your preferred sustenance? Something cold with no meat would be fabuloso. Yep, you were a vegetarian. I remember that much. Cold with no meat. Ah, uh, so clam chowder's out. Um... Corn on the cob would be hot. Cold with no meat. Peanut butter and jelly sandwich would definitely work. Let's go with it. Uh. <laughs> I would require two rations of peanut butter and jelly sandwich, please. <laughs> May I say, what a superior choice that is. Right. <laughs> Sounds amazing. Yes, it does. I am in full agreement. <laughs> You're lucky. Yeah, at least no American food. Ah. All right, so we already know horoscope. Let's go with weather. No, it's not. We're not. We're not that desperate yet. Clothing. What is your analysis of my outfit? Uh. It's not a total write-off. Uh -huh. You're obviously difficult to please. I mean, uh. not great. A turtleneck with a Letterman jacket, really. I mean, the hat's okay. That's about it. So are you digging uh -oh. my outfit? Uh -huh. it, it is exactly medium. Uh -huh. Okay, moving on. <coughs> hey, could have gone worse. Dinner is served. Hey. All right, let's see what we got. Interest, interest, hmm. occupation. We already did occupation. No, we did not do occupation. No, we did not. Hmm. Please tell me your occupation. <laughs> What? Uh, oh, uh, oh boy. Uh, He's about to shit himself. Hmm. I could have sworn we I could have sworn we didn't talk about jobs. I could swear we didn't talk about jobs. Ha. Huh. Crap. Alright. Lower, obviously. Whoa! <laughs> the one chance it could have been oh. higher. Oh, that was joy. worse than one of mine. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, uh, hey, you're at least, at least you're willing to admit it. Ew. Oh my God! What's that totally uh, disgusting stench? Uh, uh, we don't know enough about that particular trait. To no, someone else. Let's lie. Let's lie. Let's lie. It's been saving us before. Okay, please, please go to the next one. No! 
try it again. Okay, let's try it again. Please, 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 please. Oh, come on. I do not know. It was not me. The evidence would point at the waiter being the culprit. I'm positive they're completely lying about it. Uh oh. Embarrassment at levels at critical. Yep. Okay. There we go. Got rid of one of those. Nice. Alright. So, I know we talked about spiciness. Occupation I screwed up on. That is absolutely my fault. Let's talk about interests. Apparently, you have an interest in watching zombie movies. Yeah, I really like zombie movies. On interests, interesting. A little bit. That sounds both rational and logical. Yeah, it's everything. So, what do you do for kicks? Uh, conspiracy theories. Sometimes they can overlap. I have an interest in conspiracy theories. That sounds absolutely sickening. Um, I'm extremely pleased by your reaction. Okay, just barely got that. Nothing gets past you, does it? It almost did. You should totally pay the bill now. I predict the waiter will be located in the immediate vicinity. I have only a vague memory of the waiter's features. I remember Ambrosia, how could I not? <coughs> Excuse me, here is your bill. Uh, you have uh, our gratitude. Yeah. Wow, it's totes lucky you remembered what they look like. Yeah. My memory banks are functioning at normal levels. No, they're not. You have a better are memory than me. Okay, I guess. Alright, I don't know about that. I think it's time to split. Yeah. It would be expedient for us to leave. Oh. Let's see how this goes. I find them relatively attractive. Let, let's play it safe. Let's play it safe. We kind of screwed up a lot here. Actually, no. You know what? You know what? Let's go for the gold. Let's go for the gold. Go out with me. Mm. Uh. I probs would have gone on another date, but you're being well pushy, so no. <laughs> oh. Oh, no. I should have gone safe. Oh, no. No. I quite like them as well. Oh, no. I fucked it all up. Oh, great. I deserve that. I deserve that. That was my fault. That was absolutely my fault. I fucked up. I absolutely fucked up. <sighs> I should have played it safe. I should have played it safe. I should have gone with my gut. That's twice now. I've gone with my gut, and then I've decided to go out on a limb. That's both times I've screwed it up. Getting dumped is unacceptable. Unacceptable! I know. Ah, that was so great, too. Damn it. Alright. Uh, you like his eyes, but nothing else will actually mesh enough. What about the other guy, Frederick? No, that won't work either. Magic wands, old man pubs, beaded jewelry. Ah, no, that won't work. Mason Pigburn. <laughs> What's the first guy? Frederick Fleshlot. Oh, God. <laughs> okay, Mason Pigburn. Ornitholo ornithologist? Yeah, there we go. That was what it was. Inventing wacky machines, tabletop war games, and studying graphs. Okay, nothing else really meshes there. Contortionist. Hmm. Uh, Aquarius doesn't work. Uh, you like his eyes. Model trains, horror movies, and storm chasings. Hmm. And know what? You like his eyes. We'll change your hair. Let's do it. Some of this might work. All right. Let's go with the easy one. There we go. Oh, great. The king's helmet. My tummy's rumbling just thinking about it. Fair enough. Let's change your hair. I think it was ginger, wasn't it? Uh. God, they look so similar. Yeah, it was ginger. Confirm. <laughs> yeah. 
And yes, awesome. I had to double check. Let's go. Let's go try and salvage the situation that I put us in because I'm a fucking idiot. Mm. I predict an enjoyable evening. I do hope so. Mm. Greetings, fellow human. I would surmise you are Siegfried. Uh -huh. Yes, I am. You must be Tyrone. Most gratifying uh -huh. to make your acquaintance. Uh -huh. Acquaintance. Yes, that's how that works. You're right on time. Unnecessary delay would be highly undesirable. This is a nice place, isn't it? Affirmative. I would tend to agree with that conclusion. Your ocular organs are a pleasing view. Thanks. That's very nice of you to say. Also very weird of you to say. But whatever. I do love your ginger hair. I appreciate you giving me this information. <clears throat> nice beard, man. Good evening. May I take your order? Yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> what is your preferred sustenance? Mm. I'd like something hot with red meat. Hmm. Red meat, huh? Toad in the hole. What the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? Uh. Sausages and Yorkshire pudding. Uh, okay. Sausages are red meat, right? It's either that or like cashier hot pot. Which I'm assuming that's beef. Oh. Lamb, vegetable, and potato. I don't think lamb is red. Ah! I don't know enough. Uh. Savory cheese on hot. On toast served hot. Okay. So that would be the vegetable option, I'm assuming. Okay, sausages uh, uh. and lamb vegetable. I don't know enough about lamb. Let's go with sausages. Toad in the hole. <laughs> Two rations of toad in the hole. <laughs> Wonderful choice. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> Sounds delicious. <laughs> yes, it does. I am in full agreement. You're a gastronomical marvel. No, I'm not. <laughs> okay. Now, I know with him I have never talked about this. So, <laughs> occupation. Please tell me your occupation, Siegfried. <laughs> I'm actually a contortionist. <laughs> You like it? This is positive news. Yes, it is, actually. So, Tyrone, what do you do? Wig stylist. I'm currently employed as a wig stylist. That sounds good. Affirmative. It is certainly above the medium. <clears throat> hey, this is going good. Dinner is served. This is going better than I could have hoped. Let's learn a personality trait should we get the chance. Uh... Facial decor. Uh -huh. What is your opinion on my full beard? Uh -huh. mm, it's quite nice as it goes. Uh -huh. Thank you. My mood uh -huh. is buoyed by your kind words. Uh -huh. Do you like my small soul patch uh -huh. then? Uh -huh. oh, you like it? I like it. Gee, thanks. Uh -huh. Tell me, have you got any good stories? Uh -huh. oh, Affirmative. Here is one you hey. might enjoy. Hmm. In my youth, I had loquacious parrot. What? Okay. Um, I I have had a temporary memory lapse. Mm. A little bit. I once created a giant musical automaton. <laughs> and it became a virtuoso on every instrument ever created. <laughs> wow, that's a fantastic story. <laughs> Affirmative. It was the best thing since the Big Bang. Don't oversell yourself there, bud. What a delightful tale. It, it was something. I'll give him that. But it wasn't... <laughs> Slow your roll, bud. Uh. Alright, it's time to pull the love handle. Alright, let's give it another pull. See how it'll go. Uh. Turning something on real quick. No worries. And uh, clothing. Uh -huh, uh -huh. What is your analysis of my outfit? Uh, it's amazing. Yeah. I love it. <laughs> my self-esteem uh. levels are increasing. Uh, hmm. So, do you like my outfit? Uh. Come on, guy. It's not that bad. Well, let's go with that. Uh, it is exactly medium. Uh, right then. Uh, Look, the celebrated chef approaches our table. Uh, oh. 
<laughs> Good evening. I do uh, hope the food lived up to your expectations. Oh, it was great. It was great. Uh, <laughs> yes, it was lovely. I see. Would you care to elaborate fancifully? Uh, let's try this. Nut. Yeah, it was kind of like that. <laughs> sorry, that was what I was turning on. I had to. I'm sorry. I need to do it at least once every week. Huh? What do you think? Oh. Uh, apparently, I need your help. Mm. Okay. Hint. Underbelly. Texture. Overtone. Presentation. Hmm. Hmm. It had a hint of supreme beingness. <laughs> it had a texture. Uh. Whoops. Uh. That's it. I'm not standing around here to be insulted by the likes of you. What on earth did you say that for? <laughs> I seem to have made a catastrophic error. Never. I repeat, never upset the chef. You're not wrong. Hmm. That was my first screw up. I, I thought it was that. I thought it was that one. That was the third one. Damn it. Ah. We should go now. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, we should absolutely go. I screwed up. Uh. I have insufficient data to form an opinion. Let's go with another day. Uh. Do you envisage a further meeting? Yeah. Yes, why not? Uh. Excellent. I will uh. add it to my itinerary. Oh boy, I'm screwing up left and right here. They seem to fit the criteria. Definitely my type. Good. Good, it barely made up all that I spent on that date, but screw it. What is with all the stomping? Okay. Alright. Had to down a bit of my coffee. Let's see if we can keep that going. Next time, I'm just going to play it safe. Just play it as safe as possible. <laughs> I have a very pleasant time on the previous date. Well, we're going to continue with it. Even though there's not a lot there anymore. Already discussed job, facial, and clothing. I got to remember this time. All right. And... There we go. That's the one I wanted. Mario's, Mario's mansion. mansion, hey? That's a fancy choice. A little bit. A little bit. All right. Good. Just get out of here. If your client ends up in a good relationship, you'll get a re reputation bonus. We already know this. All right. Raining. Gotcha. Oh. Oh. I predict an enjoyable evening. <laughs> ah, Siegfried, we meet again. Yes, and you, Tyrone, you look well. This is another pleasant place to come to. I have no argument to offer on that point. <coughs> Alrighty. Good evening, man. Can I take your order? <laughs> Affirmative. <laughs> Preferred sustenance. Hot with fish. Ooh, excuse me. Hot with fish. Um. This looks right. Polipo a la Siciliana. I'm assuming that's correct. <laughs> Octopus salad with... Oh. Uh, oh. And tomato served cold. I don't fucking know. Octopus has fish. Sure, why not? <laughs> a very wise choice. I suppose that will do. Damn it! Are you kidding me? I thought that... It didn't tell me if it was served hot or cold. I was just assuming. Damn it. We already did that. We didn't do that. We did that. All right. Let's go with that. The atmospheric conditions today were particularly... Um, pardon me? It was raining. The weather today was bad. Yes, it was, wasn't it? Affirmative. Today's weather has now been fully analyzed. The conversation around here is pretty low quality. Nice. <clears throat> All right, so dinner is served. Here's hoping it works out. Hair again, stuff I've talked about. Okay, hairstyle. Is my hairstyle attractive to you? Yes, it looks quite nice, actually. Gratitude for your kind words. What do you think of my hair? Then? You like it? Quite attractive. That's nice of you to say so. Oh. 
I detect some anomalous peristaltic movement. Oh. I uh, definitely sense some unwanted bowel disturbance. Uh, it would be logical to try and hold it in. Beginning clenching action. Hmm. Yeah, about that. Lower. Uh, oh, thank you, merciful Jesus. Uh, Continuing to clench. Uh, oh. Okay, fair enough. Pressure levels are rising. Uh, lower. Oh, thank you for helping me. Pressure will soon be uncontainable. Snap! Ten coins. Alrighty. Emergency diverted. Returning to normal levels. Are you okay? Affirmative. I'm barely able to contain my excitement of being here. I'm really glad to hear that. Whew, I was extremely fortunate. They must have gone to elementary school. What? Okay. Okay. That's, uh... Done that. We haven't done that. We have not discussed the spiciness. Let's go with that. When watching TV, do you prefer to watch a nice period drama or watch a saucy soap opera? Good question. Probably watch a saucy soap opera. Oh, no. Oh, no. Um, drama. You're such a cold fish. You, you are not making any sense. Yes! Oh, Rosalind, obviously. Pure Well spotted. I'd forgotten what they'd look like. My memory banks are functioning at normal levels. I guess it's time to go. It would be expedient for us to leave then. Well, I mean, this is working out. Really? Still? Do you envisage a further meeting? I'm not sure. Go on, it would be entirely rational. Oh, okay then, you've twisted my arm. Come on. Hopefulness levels are moderately high. I'm feeling quite hopeful. I'm hoping at this point that I can possibly get this to work out. Possibly. This is taking all of my efforts here. This is getting difficult. All right. So, I'm back up to fabulous, barely. And here's hoping it works out. I mean, three dates. It should work out at some point. At some point. I did not envisage dating would be this much fun. Well, I mean, at this point, all we can do is hope. Gary Undershaw and Harley Dickin Ward. Oh, uh, those are some new ones. Okay. Oh, boy. We've already discussed clothing, hairstyles, facial, sauciness, occupation. Okay. Ooh. I can probably remember all that. Okay. There we go. Route 69. How delightful. Yeah. Yeah, delightful. Very delightful. Now I can only hope that this will go out perfectly. And if I have to, I'm going to lie my ass off. Because at this point, we need a win. There we go. Decent weather. I cannot fault that observation. This must be our third date. A match made in a pound shop. <laughs> okay. I really like this restaurant. It is certainly above the median. Oh, nice. I like her look. She looks nice. Good evening. May I take your order? Affirmative. Something hot with red meat. There's pretty much nothing that's better than that. Bacon double cheeseburger. Wonderful choice. Sounds delicious. Yes, it does. I'm in full agreement. All right. Done that. Done that. Fuck. All right. Um. No, that's not the direction I wanted it. 
Damn it, I didn't think it would do that. Okay. What is your opinion on horoscopes? I think they're nonsense. You're superstitious and irrational. Yes, astrology is such piffle. We are in total agreement. That's good, at least that worked out. Dinner is served. Okay. And... Weather. Ow. Just go for interest. Apparently you have an interest in... Uh, horror movies. Horror movies? Yes, I love horror movies. I tried that once. Never again. <laughs> They're not that bad. Come on. That sounds both rational and logical. Yes, I love it. So what are you into then? Uh, conspiracy theories. Interest in conspiracy theories. Wow, that sounds great. I am extremely pleased by your reaction. This is going great. There we go. Uh... Since he seems to be on the fence all the time, let's go with you. There we go. That's what you get for paying attention. Exactly. Excuse me, I'm just going to the restroom for a moment. Oh, what are you going to change? I wonder. You undid your ponytail. Everything in order? I just wanted to adjust my look. What do you think? That's it. Fuck yeah. Yeah, he just undid his ponytail and undid his yeah. little quaff there. The improvements are clear and substantial. <laughs> yeah. Ah, thank you. I love compliments. This is going great. This is going far better than it should be. Something's gonna go wrong. I just have the feeling. Okay. Let's go with organization. When putting away your felt tip pens, do you organize them by shade? Or chuck them in the box? Mm. Good question. Probably uh, organize them by shade. Uh, oh my gods, this is going better than any of them ever. So how about it? Mm. Definitely organize them by shade. Uh, Aren't we the organized pair? Uh, Our agreement uh, is total. Uh, <laughs> Here is your bill. I hope you enjoyed your meal. What amount should we tip the restaurant employee? Let's give them 5%. 5%? You stingy motherfucker. You stingy son of a bitch. No, no, no. We're, we're going off on a tangent now. You stingy ass motherfucking used to be ponytail having bitch ass motherfucker. How dare you? Mm. Mm. This, no, no, uh-uh. Nah, dates off, dates off, fuck this, fuck this guy, fuck everything about him, fuck everything about his stupid fucking face, get him out of here, get him out of here, I'm, I'm, I'm gone, I'm gone, I'm gone, I'm gone. I'm happy I left the fucking door open for that bit. <laughs> Okay, so. <sighs> Alright. 5%. You gotta be kidding me. 5%. It'd be 216. I'm fairly certain. I'm gonna double check. I'm gonna double check because, god damn it. You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. 5%. 5%? What is wrong with you? What the fuck is wrong with you, bud? Yeah, I was right. Alright. <laughs> yeah. Here's the agreed monetary bonus. <laughs> well done. Aren't you clever? Aren't you an asshole? My brain is functioning at normal levels for a genius. No, it's not. It's getting late. Yes, we should go now. <laughs> they fulfilled the criteria beyond my imagining. Will you go out with me? Hmm. So, would you like to be my significant other? <laughs> yes, my darling, I thought you'd never ask. Romance levels are at maximum. Uh, yeah, but your stinginess is also at a maximum, for fuck's sake. <laughs> it's like, I hope I slipped her a tenor just because of all of that. That's bullshit. 
All right, soulmate located, search complete. I found my soulmate. Nice. Fucking super high amount of promotion points there. Jeez. What's with all the match three games? Can't we match four or five for a change? I mean, you, you're not wrong. Okay, I'm sitting here real pretty with 295 coins. And, uh... Yeah. That last date went better than it probably should have. Uh, we found out the guy's a stingy asshole, but uh, other than that, it worked out. <laughs> so there's that, especially considering I failed again. Uh, all right, well, uh, at least we found that guy some love. At least we found one of our gays some love. That's the important part. Stingy motherfucker, but still found love. So, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more, and click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together, and I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and only Stray Cat playing games and failing once again on a date because I decided to go for the gusto and uh, that was not the instinct I should have listened to. And we got the guy a date eventually anyway. It worked out perfectly until we found out he's a cheapskate for you.